Ms. Robinson is going to demonstrate how to remove the surface barriers. This is a critical incident. She is wearing her utility gloves. If this is not done, you automatically get a fail. She's taken the contaminated instruments to the sterilization room. Now she's going to very carefully remove each cover because we know it's contaminated. Notice how she's turning the surfaces, contaminated surfaces toward the inside. Always keep the contaminated on the inside and contained. She's using the chair as her bag to keep everything enclosed. All the contamination in one spot. She's removing off of the high back and the suction. The lights, handles, and switches. Operator chair. And now she'll do the assistant chair. Notice how she's rolling it to keep the contamination on the inside. And now she's doing the handle on the bottom. So she's now going to discard the used covers into the regular waste receptacle. Step number nine, she's going to wash, disinfect, and remove her utility gloves. And now she's washing them. Notice how she has paper towels already laid out on the counter to put her contaminated stuff on. Throwing them away. She's laying her utility gloves on paper towels that she has already gotten out. Throwing away the regular gloves that she had as a double barrier protection. And now she's going to wash and dry her hands as a last step. She's using paper towels. To turn the water on. The 
making sure to get in between the fingers and her nails just like we've been shown in the past. She's doing it twice. We always do this a second time. Careful attention to the nails. Thank you. 